everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. <laughs> New title screen. <laughs> so, are you ready to probably play some lawn bowling? Maybe. That's my best guess of the things going on, because we, there's a bunch of quote-unquote delinquents around these parts, we gotta go ahead and get rid of them. You said you're going to speak with your contemporaries. Yes, I am. And that are... I mean, oh, there we go. I've been waiting for you to show up. Want to play some lawn bowls? Ah, so we are gonna play. See, we've been holding on to this thing for a while. Yeah. <laughs> but we kind of kind of have not actually been able to use that. <laughs> Seen my dad play once. You gotta land your ball near the Red Bull. Reckon that's about all there is to it. Okay. <laughs> We're using our putter, I see. <laughs> uh, I'm not really sure, like, do I just hit it at maximum power so it lands about where the Red Ball is? Or do I just kind of coast it up there with my... I don't know, well, we'll see. Woo! Oh, well, it counts! It counts! <laughs> okay, so definitely like half power for that, because this is definitely, definitely a lot faster than it looks. Oh, it, oh sad face. So, <laughs> sure, sure seems like we're, we're uh, lawn bowling, but it looks like we're actually still golfing, so I'm not, <laughs> I'm not too sure about that. Anyway, I'm knocking guys out of the ring left and right here with their pointages, I, I think. I don't, does it count? Well, like, okay, it counts. <laughs> we, we played lawn bowling, I think. Good rolling. I wonder why we don't have a lawn bowls at Wellworn. I don't know, you could set them up pretty much anywhere, really. Just, even on a carpet, you could play. <laughs> Alrighty, um, I want that spin back up, of course. Um, I kind of zip up some of this stuff here a little bit then. Uh, eh, that's fine. Wait, wait, no, 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 wait, wait. Uh, okay, nah, that's fine. <laughs> Lawn bowls might be funner than golf. I, I, I'm not, I couldn't tell the difference. Yeah, watch. <laughs> Trying to play some lawn balls here, mate. <laughs> the grounds here are so soft and beautiful. Is this what our own course would look like if we watered it and stuff? <laughs> yes. I, I think a little care could go a long way. I don't get what the big deal is. Yeah, they got some fancy stuff here. Did he got a computer? No! They've got antique clubs. The vibe on this course is great. It reminds me of home. You're my favorite golfer. Thank you. Thank you. I know you'll tear this course up. Not in the same way as us, I mean. Because <laughs> remember, they were basically just literally di making divots all over the place just for kicks. Yes. Oh. That I just start something without seeing more dialogue like they did before. Well, so <laughs> do you think you could get these people to leave? We're golfing, bro. Lucky said we could stay. Aha! So it is Lucky's. <laughs> Lucky's doing, of course. I ain't going nowhere. This is my home now. What if you just? I ain't leaving. I don't even care. You're gonna have to drag me off the course. We're gonna have to beat them in golf. What did I tell you about your outbursts? Sorry. <laughs> Remember, he's the one that. Wanted that drink at the cafe. Now, use your words. We made some friends here, and we was thinking, maybe the old dads could be friends with us too or something. Well, that's actually okay. The kids are well-meaning. I say we give it a try. Uh, yes, we can try. All right. Now I can talk. I have strong feelings about Lee being locked out of this course. That's the reason for my bad behavior. He's turning into a smart young man. They grow up so fast, hard hitting, club fitting, and I ain't kidding. Leave me alone, I'm creating. So I guess I just go talk to the other ones now and say, hey, um, they're staying. This is gonna work out just fine, right? Right, probably? They're wondering if the two groups might be able to live in harmony. Living in harmony with youngsters? Oh, we can't have that. Young uns are just too spunky. I doubt such a thing is possible. <laughs> Perhaps we could give it a try. Uh oh, Ooh! that was that's enough. <laughs> Step back, boys. I was young once. I can tell this isn't going to end without a confrontation. Just relax. They certainly talk tough, but can they back it up? Is it gonna be like young uns 
versus elders or something. Gents, round up our strongest members and gather out front of the clubhouse. Oh man. The ultimate golf battle is here, I think. This ends now. Wait, are they... Are they gonna hit golf balls at each other or something? <laughs> Who do you think you are coming onto our course like this? Who am I? Who am I? I'ma tell you who I am. I'm a hard hitting fairway splitting long driver. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> That's disrespectful. I don't know. It's okay. I only own five clubs and shoot low sixties. And lowest loft and iron is fifty. That's uh. And that might be harder to get out of bunkers with. It's possible though. This course is better than ours. Back down the audience, of course now. <laughs> I'm a long driver, chest I was here to advise you, see, plays wise. <laughs> it's a wrap up. <laughs> I never played dirty, take a divot. Fix 30 with a front nine par, 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 birdie. Oh, par, 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 and one more birdie. <laughs> <laughs> At least that's how I envision him saying it. You're a fading legend. Just throw out your wedge and head your bets in high hybrid bow. You're burnt and grip it tightly. It might help slightly. It won't hit by me, but you might drive 90. Oh! Ain't the longest, but I am the straightest. And none of you haters are close to the straightness. If you don't know by now, I'm talking fairways found. Short for me, bro, in five hour rounds. 90 hour drives, perfectly sound. Oh! <laughs> I'm iron off tees, aces on threes, stiff in the knees, but never in trees. Throwing a breeze, and I'm still at ease. You know, honestly, I don't think one is never in trees because I want to please can I get a yes please yeah Woo! see it's pointless hitting far hitting for a far to only hit a car that, that's, yeah that's kind of what they do <laughs> I don't think I have done it on purpose though you're living in a bubble so I have to pump it Good. wait, wait hold, hold on a sec hold on <laughs> didn't just notice something yeah there you go <laughs> There's little little technical difficulties there, <laughs> so I have to pop it because my part putter's gotta drop it. Double eagle will stop it, and my driver's a rocket. That's right, now I'm in space. <laughs> Cause I'm a shooting star, drive real far, and I'll hit a car when it's yours, Grandpa. Your man. <laughs> I wonder how long this is gonna go on. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Where you learn to talk like this? He's a rapper in his younger self. But you're right. I don't need a wedge when my mash he's a sledge. Understand this, pin high is my miss. Oh, face it. You ain't no shock creator, just a donator of balls to a <laughs> gator. <laughs> we should report this to the marshal. <laughs> So he, there's a cafe guy swims in there. You're an imitator, I mean an innovator, not far but straighter, all the go up and down an elevator. This cool as calm, bro. Listen, we won't matter what you're driven. When your power putts are miracles, mine's given. I know that's made you sore, but here's one more. My fans watch me sore, while well, yours are yelling for. By the way, <laughs> That technical difficulties I had was my headphones sliding out of the jack. I... <laughs> ha, that's a laugh. Be well-worn, bro. I'm a well-worn OG. You're just a well-worn oldie who's trying to school me. <laughs> this epic rap battles throughout history. <laughs> See, you're just an old nerd. Integri <laughs> integrity defer on the course, stealing balls like a cheeky bird beak. Leaderboards always last. Your name's unheard, except in match play. My come third. You can't beat me, bro. I soar like a bird. My setup's absurd. All the best gear, blades preferred. Oh, wait a second. I think they have something in common here. The older clubs are all blades, and he's using blades, and or, or she's. I, I, 
I think it's a, I don't know, it's a Huey or she. I'm not sure. It's, it's hard to tell with the sprite, but still. But still. They might, they might be coming to a, a truce soon. Gear don't come for nothing, bro. <laughs> maybe not. I've been on their power since I played with me pod, maybe in the long in the past. When Nippick was the main stick, it's the kids didn't stop quick. You had to lay up short, play in short shots and shorter shorts. <laughs> no dress codes on the courses, and we shared them with the horses. Ooh! And I stepped in horse poop all day long, cause this were the past. Swings weren't fast, clubs made to last, and the players were class. Clubs are still made to last, that doesn't make much sense. I mean, if, if they weren't made to last, that would be a safety hazard. The, the, the heads could fly off and hit someone down the fairway. <laughs> Uh-oh. I think... I think the young un's lost. That's enough. Oh no, mad props, Grandpa. That was legit. Hey, you're not so bad yourself. We'll get out of here. They say in our turf. No need. I'm sure we can find a way to coexist. I guess what they found in common is that they're both love rap. <laughs> Effective immediately, I'm making you a permanent member here. You can't do that. <laughs> Memberships is my job here. Unreal. You know what? I'm making you a member of Well Worn Grove. Wait a second, they have a membership? I thought anyone should just walk on over there and play. After what I had to go through to join those clubs. <laughs> okay, so I guess Well Worn does have a slight membership thing. Well, that takes care of them. There, there appear to be a couple left. Hmm? We ain't going nowhere. We shall not be leaving. We shall not be going or whatever. <laughs> This is our course now. You want us gone? Play us on our home turf. We'll see who wins. Oh, very well. I'll join the group. <laughs> Ours are there. Wait a second. Don't tell me the dog is going to play golf. Because they they have four, three on the left side. We have five. So I'm betting he's going to go... Uh, my character is going to go flop on theirs. Yours. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Bad prediction on my part, but I tried. Very well. Let me know when you're ready to depart. Um. Well, aside from the epic rap battle, not not a lot really went, went on in this part. So even though it's already in like 12 minutes to this part, I'm kind of, kind of, you know, kind of lacking in content. So I should probably probably go ahead and play that Well Worn Grove tournament. Hmm. I do hope we win. They're actually very lovely boys. Mate, you ain't gonna beat us. Uh, hmm. Maybe. Maybe. We should let these guys win this time. Although, I don't know. <laughs> You're looking nice today, Rudy! 36 in the uh, same dialogue. <laughs> and youngsters finally just can't keep up when they come to our core. Same dialogue. Uh, no. Well, I guess. I probably I probably do have to win to pro progress the story, I'm guessing. We'll take the driver shot on each hole, you can take over thereafter. WHAT?! These old bones ache. Long courses are a young man's game. <laughs> but the tee shot is the most physically demanding. I'm not long off the tee, but I hit him dead straight every time. <laughs> I'll set them up, you knock them down with safe play. Remember, a safe six has been- No! <laughs> Rather the messy four. I agree! <laughs> The lowest score is the winner. Alright, here we go. After our epic rap battle, we go on to an epic team battle. Like with the coaches versus the students. Well, actually, there's no coach and. Oh, no, that? You said. Well, at least that one person said it wasn't in the trees. <laughs> well, well, well. I should probably be able to get out of that just fine. I hope. Eh, uh, well, hmm, let's see what we got here. Ooh, oh, ooh, hmm. Uh, I should probably go do a little curvy curve. And... I just, I guess, roll it out as far as I can with top spin. Maybe, maybe add a little power to that. See if we can manage to get... Roll it up to the green. I don't know. I'm in kind of a bad spot, but I think that's the idea of this game at this point. That I didn't know there was a mole there. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> well, 
Well, that's not that bad, really. Well, assuming that they don't have any issue playing out of bunker, unless I'm going to be playing out of the bunker, which will be just fine. And <laughs> wait a second, are they going to put the balls right on top of each other? How's that going to work? <laughs> the ball is overlapping with the X, and okay, I guess they're they're marking it with the X, and then you could safely hit around it or or something. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> Not too sure about this, but go ball into the hole, please, or at least some are close. It's, yeah, that's good. I am in a slightly better position than they are, and it looks like that I am indeed doing the shots aside from the drive, just like before, so yeah, it's not alternate shots, so we should be okay. As a matter, as a matter of fact, I think we're better than okay, looking at the way that was playing was going, because... I will find opportunities as I go through this, you know, if, if they keep putting me in bad position like that, but chances are I'll be able to find my way out of those, out, out of some of those spots and have an even easier time than they would, at least in theory. <laughs> Alright, par four. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, this is a short par four, so it should be alright. Maybe. <laughs> I mean, they got pretty pretty far compared to us. So I've got a long, long shot to kind of control its landing on here. But let's see what I can do. I should probably be able to hold the green by putting that backspin on it. Come on, baby. Come on. Yes! I just didn't want to go into mole territory. So I just kind of played towards the fat area. It went a little bit more to the right than I was expecting. But eh, eh, still worked out nice. And that was, uh, oh my. I, I'm really beginning to wonder if I am supposed to let them win because it's, <laughs> this is looking very hard to lose. Let's just put it that way. Uh, there's, there's, oh no. <laughs> All right, I, I have three putts to win this. This, this is a lot of pressure on me. I don't know if I can do this. Oh, I, I managed to push through the nerves and get that birdie. Whew. All right. So, I guess as long as I can get escape from whatever they put me in like that, and they flub a lot, I should have no issue. Oh, okay. That's all, that, that's all right, I guess. Oh, we, can, we can live with that, just as long as it's not in the trees or something like that. We are good. That was not, though. Man, I'm kind of feeling bad for them. Because they, they really want to stay here, and I think we do have to beat them to advance the story. Uh, how'd I go for that power? Yeah, look at that power. So much power! 292 yards of doom! This is kind of probably unnecessary in all honesty, but I don't know, just trying stuff. You know, I, st I still have not tried that focus for the wind, you know, to get through the wind type of shot. I have not tried that once yet somehow. Maybe I should just do it for kicks. I, just, I don't know, I'm just so used to playing the wind that I haven't really felt the need to play for the focus. And that one challenge that I had, ridiculous wind, that cheeky beak peak, you know, that side quest type thing, that was a... Uh, it, 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 it didn't really let me use the power focus things, and yeah. By the way, I noticed that, uh, yeah, I got the tee up thing. I noticed that on the uh, title screen thing there, but I haven't really needed to use that either because well, it literally is, is, at least what I'm figuring, is teeing up the ball anywhere, which gets you out of situations. But that, I... I'm not really in that bad of a position in a lot, <laughs> in a lot of times. I guess I could use it when I am uh, being. Oh, that was not a good move. Wow, you actually lost the yardage there. But yeah, the uh, uh, teeing up thing. I guess I could use in the woods or something like that when I'm in the rough and I have a bad liar or something. Okay, that was a good shot. I'll give you that one. <laughs> but other than that, I, I just. I just haven't really felt the need. I did, everything's been going pretty peachy keen with my course of management. <laughs> so, I mean, I, they're there for me to use, but I haven't really just needed to use them, I guess. I don't know. Just how things have rolled. But I really do want, 
I'll at least see how they how they react to stuff, you know. So I might just give them a shot just because, maybe in this match, because things are going pretty easy. Like this one, because I, I was putting the deep rough there. You know, I, I suppose I could tee it up, just to get out of deep rough technically. At least I think. I don't know if there's tees long enough to get out of deep rough in all honesty. But I guess we can see. Uh, yeah, C, T, zero yard range. But if you're in deep rough, you got the 20 yard range. And you also, you know, you get the the benefits of having a perfect lie, so you won't lose distance in general on your shot. So that is good. So I guess I'll, I'll just give it a shot, even though I pretty much knew what the poop that thing was going to do to begin with. Just because I can. <laughs> Beautiful. And that's probably another point for me. Well, I should say our team. Hello. Hello. Who really wins in such a match? I mean, the young uns seems like the elders want a round, so, hmm, I don't know. They might just let them stay after all. We'll see. I wanna go ahead, or maybe this is like a, gonna be like a split storyline or something like that, and you have to play the game twice over, and instead of the young uns getting booted out, the young uns end up staying and the elders get moved to Wellworn Grove or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if there's multiple storylines. This is blind. <laughs> I'm just taking some guesses here. Uh, that'll do. That will do indeed. And yes, I know that they're, that I'm purposely being left out at a disadvantage regardless of the uh, the drive that they do because they're not driving it very long. Holy poop! That was a helpful mole! <laughs> never have I seen... Never I thought I would see the day. <laughs> oh, jeez, I got the pro woods. I can't skim across the water. Um, well... Oh, I should actually see as long as the wind is high. I'll do the focus and uh, just aim directly for the fairway. Like, I'll just use that as a vantage point, this little bush that's directly above my cursor, and see how the wind uh, reacts to my ball here. Ready? Ready? Unless focus just means the beaner goes really slow, because that was really slow. Oh, the wind didn't affect that at all. That's pretty cool. Okay, so focus completely eliminates the wind. So if it's really windy, I suppose I could use that to cut that out and now, wow! Fantastic shot! <laughs> I was not expecting that. And, oh no, I still can't, still can't get the birdie badge on the hole because I, I'm not even allowed to finish it. <laughs> Wait, actually no, I still wouldn't have been... I wouldn't have had a birdie chance anyway because that would have been my third shot to get on the green. And then four in. Assuming everything went well. Unless I somehow managed to chip it in like they did. Oh! Oh! Oh no! <laughs> I might just. I might have to tee it up just to be able to catch up, but let's see. Uh, well, actually, no, it's not, it's not too bad, honestly. Because if I hit it into the deep rough, it'll just kind of automatically cut off the power and it'll roll up to the hole, I think. Hopefully, it won't over roll. Uh, yeah, that'll work. I mean, I'm putting off the green, but we know putting off the green works pretty well in this game, so. Eh! Why would you aim way over there? I don't know. <laughs> maybe because it's the chunkier side of the green? Maybe? At that. I, no, maybe not. It's, I think it's chunkier to the right. Hmm. Hmm, I'm mystified. Anyway, the slope is breaking over to that side. Go in. Yes! And we got our point back. <laughs> and I. Yeah, I think we won. Yeah. <laughs> I was just gonna say, I think it's over. Yeah, I guess he did have to win this to advance the story, at least I think. Unless, as I said, there's a split story, like split timeline or something like that. I don't know. Uh-oh. Good round, men. I didn't think anybody as young as you had a chance, but you played pretty well for a young feller. So, well, in fact, we should invite him to the tournament. Yes! Wanna play in a tournament, son? You bet! I'd love to! Should be a bit of fun. Oh, I just noticed that. Look at the cutoff at the bottom right corner of this room with the, the, the steam. You see that little block of extra graphics? <laughs> uh oh! 
Oh, actually at the bottom right too. Must be something with the tile set. <laughs> of course, Dusty will probably win. Does every does every year. I wouldn't call on that. He still competes even though he's on the Pro Tour? He's not on the Pro Tour, huh? He didn't take the deal? What are you talking about? Oh, that ancient rule? That rule no longer applies. What? <laughs> So, even if we win the tournament, it looks like we can't get on the Pro Tour. Some fell that disappeared with the old rule book, so we can't prove the rule ever existed. Dang! <laughs> we didn't pay it much mind, anyway. None here would want to join the Pro Tour. They already get to play the best course day in, day out. This course. <laughs> even, with, even though the greens are a little overgrown. Where did this man, man with the book disappear to? Yeah, somewhere snowy. <gasps> we can finally go to the snow area? Ish? Like maybe the blizzard has calmed down? Said there was a great potential out there. Well, said there was great potential out there. Not a great potential. Wanted to grow the game of golf or something. So he lent him the book. Never came back. I will find this man. I will go to the snow-capped mountains. In the next part. <laughs> Just want to see here. Yeah, oh wow, yeah. That's definitely where we're going. Assuming we can go there, maybe we'll need like a, a coat or some go goggles or something like that. Uh, yeah, looks like. Wait, what? So, oh, that, oh, that's a part of the same thing. So they didn't combine them; they just kept them separate or something like that. I don't know why they did that. Usually, it's like when you when you do one thing, it oh, it erases the other one, just kind of you know get you back on track when you know the place that you're supposed to go and stuff. So yeah, a crafty old man. You gonna no new dialogue, huh? Well, well, it looks like we're heading off to the snow place then, huh? Or will we? Or will we? Because I think I am gonna dare to play his course, yes, his course, in the next part. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you then when I will probably get everything I've known and love handed to me in a bad way. 